Yeah, Mike, according to this criminal complaint, that house was condemned by the building inspector today, deemed unfit for humans. But when we went to the property tonight, we found three people there on the porch who were very unhappy to see us. You don't know the facts, don't make a story about it. This is the house on the 200 block of Marlin Street in Knoxville that Pittsburgh police officers say was filled with feces, clutter and garbage. Officers say there were no working toilets and they found a gallon jug half full of urine on the same floor. Two small children were sleeping. The people we encountered there tonight shouted obscenities and threats at us. Do you want to give us any comment about the the condition of the house and children being left in filth? You better get out of my face. You have no comment, ma'am? Nope. According to the criminal complaint, police arrested Jennifer Badamo and her boyfriend Eric Hill for endangering the welfare of their two kids ages five and four. They were taken to Children's Hospital in protective custody. Police say Badamo told them she was homeless until her aunt Zola Campbell let them stay here at the house. Police say inside there were six small dogs also living in filth, five of them with nails that were grossly overgrown, another severely matted and filthy. Officer Christine Luffy wrote in her report, quote, the small path that I was able to walk on in the living room, dining room and kitchen was covered in feces. The kitchen was beyond deplorable. Police described the odor as overwhelming and standing across the street tonight, it was evident. Badamo and Hill were brought here to the Allegheny County Jail. Both of them are charged with endangering the welfare of children. A CYS caseworker has been brought in to determine what will happen to those kids in the future. Reporting live outside the Allegheny County Jail, I'm Jackie Kane, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.